October 10, 2021. Yesterday I hit the trail, a really interesting trail. Uh, it's called a blood trail. It was called, it was referred to as a blood trail, literally blood trail. Blood trail by Americans alone. Um, on that trail, pretty much uh, all the cards opened in respect to my case about exactly what was used against me, how did whatever you want to call them um, it's a very very important video I think not only for the Eastern Europeans, not only for the Slovenian people to, to observe it's a very important people for people in the US, in Britain in Germany to see, understand exactly about what goes on. Uh, and this blood trail, let me demonstrate to you. We, I'm referring to Novo Maestro Seon, it's a trail. This is a trail. Uh, some interesting stuff I did post it on my news site also times. Let's see this blood trail. I'm just going to do it like this. I suppose not. As you know, Melania Trump is from uh, Sionica. From this city right here, and I am from Novo Mesto, but this is pretty much almost according to the US standards, man. That's like going from Miami to Fort Lauderdale. No, 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 no. Let me demonstrate you directions, good directions, my location. Okay. Oh, we're going to do it by walk. That's 33 kilometers, actually. That's what I... I did more than that yesterday. Uh, I didn't go... I, I don't know how much is in there uh, to the city, this and that. I came out of the forest, right, at where the Aldi is. Uh, and so... This here, this is about a distance right here. So, then we are talking about 32. All right, we're roughly talking about 65 kilometers. And um, it's known as a blood trail. Yeah, that's exactly what it's about. About 65 kilometers I did yesterday. Uh, across the hills. Uh, across this place here, it's called the Lecce. Uh, this is a Klenovic, and all this crosses Klenovic, all these little villages over the course of the years, over the course of the time. There must have been like Aha, uh -huh, here it is. Uh, there must have been, uh, over the course of the years through here, uh, right here to save it, so, uh, probably like a 50 females maybe that, that they found me, meaning they destroyed probably, I don't know, maybe 50 of them. Do you understand? Kill. Yeah, that was the grand idea next to the biddings on how to basically label me as good as dead portray me as a traitor because of what was done to me I 
I started to instigate into insane stuff under MK Ultra uh, and was depicted to the people as everything but a human being. If you would translate, there is a village here, I don't know, it's a Telche. Uh, but they were, they were telling me on one occasion, American told me, if translated, There was a girl from there uh, that I understand was interested in me and I don't know but every one of these scenarios ended with a tragedy. Uh, they started to interfere because she was from that place as a, as a cult. No, 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 you don't understand what kind of people I, I, I had to deal with. Um, I, I understood in dire background about what exactly was implemented throughout more than 25 years against me on this, on this trail. Blood trail because it was numerous families destroyed numerous lives destroyed and uh, I was portrayed as the worst of the worst because US government knew and so did the German um, Mr. Joe Biden Mr. Joe Biden this is why I said in the beginning of the video that This is important video for everyone, for you to see how this stuff is done. Why? I know I'm, I'm not the first one. I know I'm, not, I'm definitely not the first one. Listen, um, I see through you. Uh, I am not interested in just one true. Because there are many to this story. And there are many to other people from the West. Uh, so... My power within comes from uh, want to know how this stuff was done. <laughs> they cluster this stuff to impossible, but the thing is that I know they had people here that claimed that they were MK Ultra victims. That, that received enormous payouts. There was a guy that would keep coming here that claimed it was two billion dollars that he received, and all kinds of shit like this. But I'm telling you, folks, and I know it's many families throughout the US and elsewhere too. Many of you relatives have seen your own people die in front of you. It could well have with the nations that went into a precipice, into disasters, through the cases like this. And they always got away with it. We never heard anything from it. Um, what fascinated me about this money case is that in 2017, there was a Slovenian guy who had a silicon mask from Joe Biden. That's where things got really, really interesting. Um, when brought to United States of America, this individual, however, had American guy next to him that came here. Uh, to record the tape 
so you're talking about Joe Biden, and I know for f de facto, I know, and this is shit is related to Ursa and the Lane. Look to this lady here. That was a teaser, this Ursula. This Ursula, let me tell you about Ursula van der Leyen. Ursula van der Leyen got in the picture to me, like, very early on. Uh, and uh, she gained uh, interest from me because I like her physically. I mean, it's just a beautiful woman, right? So, was. I mean, very beautiful woman. And so, she gained attention as I, I see this stuff here that uh, Pope Francis met today with the Joe Biden um, listen know this Pope Francis Ursula von der Leyen no actually German government sometimes in uh, 99 uh, gained attention by literally having me in the pool. There was a pool, a lot of people in there. It wasn't, it wasn't, uh, uh, this was like some kind of a German place they opened uh, to the public 2000, maybe year 2000, around 2000. Uh, and we we were staying wherever the hell that is, you know. So that that must have been. It's not even difficult for me to find out because, you know, when I match construction. So I said about the year two thousand, uh, and I match that they were doing on this project, and then I can I can, I can know for sure this was in Germany pretty much what what project that was completed uh, that we were at because you're talking about quite inside pools and uh, these politicians what they do is you know this is just like this they, they 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 get you she showed me her tits I'm gonna put it this way uh, and I was pleased, you know. They make you believe like they're that you are special to them. Claimed me that in '99, so that was in 2000. You now in '98 and in '99, that has a crisis at home. That has uh, told me that has uh, <laughs> that, that that was Angela that has uh, one or two child, something like this, and the husband, uh, no, no, is going to be yours, and I don't know what. Uh, Ursula, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Uh, so, they, they brainwash you to believe that they, there is actually some kind of relationship uh, there is actually more, even than a politic, there is actually more than a friendship. Uh, like a hidden sympathies and shit. They, oy, not one politician. It was many like this. So listen up, folks, what I am talking to you, whatever the fuck you are. Because these people always got away with it. A tip about beating was good the tip about in front of the women that they would promise uh, marry this guy and you get 30 million I, I don't know pounds or whatever if he marries you and so this parents and ladies would jump on you like uh, ants with hope that sometime this is going to happen, and it was oftentimes this shit was played next to like totally models, you know what I mean? Wealthy people, billionaires, and these people alone fucking owe you like a half a trillion dollar according to their words. Okay, so that's like a completely different planet next to a totally totally different 
world, basically, that somebody else is experiencing in his view. And it, the idea is to just kill and kill and kill and kill and kill and make the person look like, even like it's a traitor to the country. They kill you. They turn like this in Slovenia. I don't know how many women was here like this. They destroyed maybe 200 women in Slovenia. You understand? And they did this shit all over Ukraine and Poland and Czech Republic and Slovakia. And the only thing was destitution. Even in Russia, they did fucked some uh, people. And in Serbia too. And so listen to me, folks. U.S. government, the Joe Biden, the guy, the Slovenian guy who had a silicon mask, American guy was next to him. And I know so because I found plenty of chestnut. The chestnut was the one that brought Norwegian King Harald to Slovenia. Actually, for the King Harald, you know, I, I am angry. I am angry because uh, he did not express more sympathies for me, but I think that he couldn't, he couldn't express more. If it's the one person I, 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 just because, you know, just because I think that, that he really cared about me, you know, even that, that I would give him a slap, you know. No, 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 no. You know, he, he insulted uh, sometimes but um, listen um, I swallow the insults I do that uh, for a good person if it's a good hearted person I do I do that I don't know how much he was capable I know that in 99 when they swear they're going to destroy me he, he was understand the only one who protested against this that he's going to save me no matter what even despite you know, people like Donald Trump and uh, vicious motherfuckers in this case, excuse me, Pope Francis, especially if you watch this video, excuse me, that insisted like, yeah, 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 we're going to destroy this guy, you know, like hurrah, hurrah, hurrah. And um, I got two vendettas, you know, promises now, man, I got a lot of promises that they're going to destroy me. Not that I care for one, a single one of them. Um, but it was bad. It was so fucking bad that Russians, when Charles told me that he's going to destroy me, the Russians would like, like go like this. Uh, Russians didn't like me, but when they saw this shit and it was done in front of them, Charles promises he's going to destroy me. Sometimes I think like in, I don't know, like after that 96, when I saw him as a traitor, man, I, I would never see the motherfucker anymore. Like something like a part of me, I would always look him like over the shoulder. If he would test me with something, like test me, the only thing that was, was boom. That's how you do with the people like this. That's all you do. You don't test a fucking thing. When you become a traitor, and you are a traitor, Charles. You have no fucking right to test anybody. Person that gives something on himself. Once they get you, you're a traitor. No, you're fucking nobody to test anybody anymore. That's why you lost all the points in 96 with me. Once you did that stuff, that's all there is. You just zick, cross. You go along, you follow, or bam. This is the way that's done according to me. Even as a drug top, I knew what the hell I want. You no longer basically have anything to say since 97. Now, if I could help, because you were in that position of, of the British throne, I help, but not because of you, man. You understand? Not because of you. So, just for me to clarify the issue I had with the jobs, because I told you that you're fucking incompetent and lazy and good for nothing. What actually Philip thanked me is, you said I heard your feelings. Um, it's not difficult 
to be a workaholic. I saw this news. It's not difficult. When you go and you collect the money when the money is raining down on you, this is a difficult part to be. It's difficult when you're in my situation where you have fucking less than nothing. When you have a place to sleep and you have a motherfuckers like you going after to kill every hope in a person. Now that's difficult. That's a workaholic. Not everybody is a workaholic and the workaholic is not a negative news. This is a good news. I applaud people that are workaholics. This is nothing to be ashamed of. The workaholics know in this world what's right from wrong. The workaholics are concerned people, concerning people for other well-being as well. So I can tell you from every aspect, from every point, from every corner, that you're no fucking good. You're no workaholic. Still, I'm going to tell you this after I don't know, 22 years, whatever. Okay? You understand? And so what I wanted to say... Okay, I get a little bit emotional here and there because it's a, it's a stuff these people just... Well, get to that stuff. I spoke about the book that Charles got translated in I don't know how many languages to. The book definitely exists. The book definitely exists. I know. The book about me, about MK Ultra case, which Charles called as a bestseller absolutely exists and I know so look I know so because of this stuff here look you see this here alone tells me that the book exists now there are numerous other cases like this the Belarus guy Sergey knew about this he was telling me where to take the picture from so the the, the book definitely 100 next to all the other incidents and what Charles thanked me for for this stuff definitely exists there is such thing like a book you know this is the post you just want to see um, read over so that you can understand uh, what exactly I am talking about now, now the problem with this book you know I got a problem with this book Charles the problem with the book is that the book is different in a different language that I speak meaning that the book is not telling the truth whatever you translate it I bet people who had that book in their hands including my uncle let's say who started to see me as a traitor now that's fucking crazy because my family knows that they have not seen anybody as Slovenian as I am uh, no fucking way would you get me in a real time going against Slovenia. This is impossible. It happened after the shit days that, 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 that I had an open outburst when I started to talk in 2010 about MK Ultra, and you would not want to admit what happened. And you had still Russians and Udba going after me followed me around, doing things to me, uh, and so it exploded in 2011. But it's impossible you would get me against Slovenia. This is impossible. This is what resented me so many of the Western leaders that I would not uh, compromise my country, my people. No fucking way could you possibly get me. Under MK Ultra, I, I was insane sometimes. I didn't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Uh, I, I I felt tremendous injustice, especially because I'm so loyal to this nation. And so the beatings and all that kind of stuff, you know, <laughs> this is difficult, very difficult to explain. But what I want to say to you people, they have medications for everybody whatever the fuck you are, for every country specifically that needs to be destroyed from within and through one person, through one, in an individual, they always know what the issue, what the turmoil is inside. What I'm talking to you right now does not necessarily applies 
to I don't know, maybe Romania or Bulgaria or whatever country. What applies to me, not necessarily will apply to Bosnia or, or, or Croatia next door with practically the same problems. These are issues that are totally adjusted to the certain interests, uh, potential takeover of the country, therefore enemies and so on. Okay, so the two are not the same. So I know when my uncle, who read this book, he absolutely did. He talked to me about that uh, he, he, he no longer, that my views are no longer pro-Slovenian, that that's impossible. When I spoke to him, I told him under MK Ultra, that is fucking impossible, I told him. And, and he looked at me like, like how the fuck impossible? Eh? I mean, like five minutes ago, you, I, I could say something under MK Ultra when I was drugged up that needs to be done here with the Slovenia, I don't know what the fuck. And five minutes later, they told me that you are a Slovenian traitor, and I would tell you, that's fucking impossible. You see, the thing is that this is almost world within the world within the world within the world this isn't about mk ultra and reality no there are different uh like almost spaces created within issues inside that this shit went on for like 25 years more i was still brought in 2019 from poland so it was more than than 25 years you understand and it all depends what kind of drugs and, and so on, the effect on brain they had on, on your ability to relate yourself to more issues or less issues. What I want to say to you is like this. That's what shocked me the most. I was really good about this chestnut, right? We go back to the story about the chestnut. Along the trail to Sevens, there is a lot of fucking chestnut, you know? And really, the Norwegian king would keep coming back, <laughs> and he would keep be, being around his uh, locals. He got a lot of people, all kinds of jobs around here, around this blood trail. Uh, some people he would get them would be accounting, and other people he would get them, I don't know. I don't know what, yesterday I saw the guy that then disappeared because they know the fuck I'm even when I walk and I record something and uh, somehow fuck somehow they hear I don't know what exactly they fucking see and know what what the stuff I do but they know because the guy I wouldn't see him anymore all right the same shit like the guy that identify and they told me that's going to be the case like like he's selling the car I was told if you're going to know who who the person is you can't say this is the guy bought the card then he's got this he's got that and then call the person you're not the, the person is not going to be available and it happens like this this is something i was told unless you make a mistake then it's available it's that kind of stuff that's how is this this shit played um chestnuts story ended like this that the guy the American guy like Chestnut <laughs> I don't know who doesn't uh, and because so much Chestnut um, Slovenian guy I know so fuck my mom doesn't speak a single word of English uh, so definitely the guy was 100% he also spoke to me in Slovenian language so I was like fuck this guy this guy speaks uh joe biden also also listen to this also speaks english hmm, how the fuck does he speak english uh well obama did obviously another slovenian dude with the silicon mask of obama at the dm store in uh, right here this um Jabiavas, whatever, at this center that they had, there was enormously, they play with the uh, MK Ultra, that's a, a store kick and uh, DM and Interspar and shit like this. Um, so I knew that 
something here that goes very, very wrong. So this is what I like this story about the chestnut. It was asking mom if she would borrow him a car so that he could go the next day because the boat went from trail, fucking weird. Because the real Joe Biden, I remember from the U.S., when we met him, when the Trump and I met this dude, uh, therefore you, Joe, um, whatever, upstate, uh, on a hiking, uh, you, you are not so, you have a specific style where you walk, and um, due to age, due to wear and tear and this and that, you are not so uh, fucking uh, guy with the silicone mask was uh, <laughs> he carried on throughout the entire fucking trail and uh, you now it didn't really appear that he would be uh, I don't know exhausted you know uh, well dressed and everything just like a real Joe Biden shit you know type of stuff um but this is when it gets really, really, really interesting. The American who mom did borrow the car, he got the car. Uh, I was not. She would borrow me today, father's car, so I would go pick up the chestnut. <laughs> Crazy stuff. Germans wanted this fucking story about the chestnut. Watch out. Again, von der Leyen. A chestnut will be very expensive if we have this in the Lidl and Hofer. Sure is, five euros per kilo. It's like very expensive. And next to her free advices, like... Uh, free cancer cure. So was uh, go get yourself a chestnut in the forest. And if we see you spending uh, money on a chestnut at Hofer or Lidl, you dead, you dead, you dead. Okay, I agree. We don't mind if the people have money, but if people don't have money and we see this, we rate them as a mentally retarded. Okay, so I'm successfully Mr. In Between. Who knows? Mr. Between, because, because, you see the shit that I post on my website. These accusations are not just baseless stuff. Every one of them is based on what I know, what I learned from it. And it bothers me. It bothers me because I know that this bullshit is American German stuff. This is American German stuff because it was Van der Leyen who told me, yeah, completely, uh, completely, completely, completely uh, with the Joe Biden. Uh, but that we we might not tell you that stuff. We will not uh, admit this about uh, she was briefed American staff briefed her basically on what exactly happened right and once they briefed her exactly what happened during this stay of this fake Joe Biden and uh, you know this American guy uh, she started to fuck with me uh, about everything, including about this, uh, that Joe Biden is actually authorized Slovenian, well, obviously government-related individual, uh, to play with a silicon mask using American guy to ensure that everything stated would only be stated in his name, therefore any kind of deviation from the scenario that Joe Biden okayed to this Slovenian guy could be a trouble, could have a, as a result conflict between the US government and Slovenian government. So this is, this, this is therefore, these are in agreement, but the Germany knew absolutely every line, every outline. They knew everything, tick, 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 tick about Exactly, exactly, exactly what happened. They did not brief Ursula, and I know so, because <laughs> I remember 
once man i swear to god that as we would travel as ursula would also come on this brief visit whatever it was nothing but fucking three days of briefing to her about uh, what exactly said and this and that and tra la 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 so these people are in complete agreement i did not say that american government and german government this is just you, you think I just pulled something like that? No. No, by, by any chance, it's absolutely not. Joe Biden told me, one, then I was brought to the U.S., Joe Biden told me, well, he said to me, we do the stuff like this, we do the stuff like this, but just as I have explained, uh, we're probably not going to carry okay, this and that. Okay, so we have Obama, we have Biden, and we have myself, uh, who I will say, I will put it this way. That's why I said at the beginning, watch this, whatever the hell you are. Um, what they are trying to portray certain political party like a positive something like they want certain interests for that political option that's when you're going to have this kind of situation in the u.s that's why it's not only about anti ultra space within the space whatever uh this also this stuff would be like this it would they they had they implement systems like this for themselves too they have organized like this that they use certain issues so they can they can get this thing they can get things going their way basically for person to see it their way yeah that's how they they do it so that means that uh, obama too uh, all these people is probably more than that who god knows what's going on uh, completely uh, did this uh, with the Slovenian this for me very important these are real people we are talking about uh, not a fucking silicon masks people that I was brought here and blah blah this is a late stage you're talking about 2017 you're talking about 2015 you're not talking about 95, 2000 and stuff like that. So, uh, that means that they're in a complete intergovernmental agreement. You're going to have people like this, uh, not only West completely interconnected with one another in respect to one issue, certain issue but you're gonna have also with your government wherever you are doing exchanging this uh with expected feedback basically with expected results which i couldn't be more specific about it that there might be a fraction within your government that will be running stuff and the biggest fucking problem of them all maybe even the majority that see themselves like I have indicated for certain people in Slovenia, like Janis Janša, Petrle, Luisa Petrle, that see themselves more in global module rather than as part of the local society. It's a fucking problem with these people because they don't understand that the two things are connected, interconnected. Now, when you get ultimatum, either it's going to be this and like this it evidently you the victim don't be idiot and don't settle for either this or that never ever should you give away what is yours and so and they say don't let the small bird out of your hands and reach out for i don't know big bird on the roof uh, maybe in a way applies to that stuff uh but it's the politicians like this that you need to condemn and just as those that work openly for the sake of the enemy they're not even hiding behind their interests you understand that's why i said good stuff for you to watch whatever the hell you are
whether you are, um, whatever you are, doesn't matter. For you to understand that this is just not an issue like, of black and white. There are so many, many, many these spaces, modules that are connected uh, into a bigger, greater picture that these people have distorted picture to the degree that my fucking okay excuse me it's not fucking uncle but okay my uncle stated to me that uh, you 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 don't even see yourself as a slovenian anymore you know i that's basically how that stuff goes so i don't know how you want to title this video joe biden with a silicon mask uh, I will title one probably as added Joe Biden with a silicon mask added to my wish list. <laughs> How about that? Uh, maybe Ursula von der Leyen, liar, that had Americans even insist me that some of her children are my children. Oh, you know how deep this shit is. Uh, we will see about this. Uh, maybe she can put a check mark, a green check mark. Just because I wasn't so fucking nice. How about that? Because I always was the thing. Only if you're going to be nice. I don't think the nice people ever get through anything. Charles. But Philip, he okayed my issue. He said that you became more grown up, more tougher. That you were too soft before. Uh, that helped you go carry on throughout the life that you that you maybe maybe you became a workaholic who the fuck knows i don't know man uh one thing i'm gonna say about the british royals and germans too that, that they were coming here that was kind of really 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 nice uh, but i uh, it, it was making me nervous it was making me nervous because th th this when they were brought brought me here this MK Ultra, I did basically whatever I wanted, pretty much. And I wanted to see others also like in a leisure style, relaxed and talk. And these people would always go like Charles and every fucking morning he would go, he had a habit to shave himself, tick 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 tick. Uh clean himself, bath himself, uh Andrew, the same thing. All of them uh, clean themselves, fucking clean, and will come up fucking out with a tie, with this, with that. My God, fuck! That looked like a professor from the college. Worse. Ah, uh, I was like, how the hell to uh, losing these people a little bit, man? And these Americans, the same shit. Um, and then they would engage throughout the day in a very very pleasant mode with the people and they would be nice um, in a way not a bad people uh, definitely good potentials I would say the first time that I actually liked Russian KGB's guys that uh, they also knew that I liked them in that moment. It was when the Russian KGB, uh, he was, he was, they were like fucking excited. That was 98. 98 at least, if not 99, 98. They were excited about how I heard Charles. They were laughing like, ha 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 ha. Uh, now, you, uh, now you're fucked. Now you're fucked. Um, and not a little later after that that's basically when Charles told me that my life is going to be the one jobless that I had no fucking idea 
what that he have done to Andrew, to Prince Andrew. Also, psychologists told me they accented. Well, he got his brother. They cited me few people how he fucked. And got his brother, they got his own brother under control. Well, well, well. Uh, and the Russian guy was, uh, after a little while when they heard, probably Charlie really, really getting excited, emotional about it, they went like this. <laughs> like this. And it was the first time I liked this KGBs because I saw in their eyes, because I saw in their behavior, there was actually concern. There was actually something human about it. And I became almost kind of certain that that maybe there is a chance that actually they would that they changed about. And I, I it was actually the time that the first time from my side that I actually reach out toward them. It was not successful though. Lucky for me. Yeah, and uh... Donald Trump told me obviously to refer to Prince Harry is mental, mental, mental. And uh, they told me under MK Ultra, uh, they wanted that, they incited that with the local registers, you would go to the stores. And in Poland, everywhere, they try to remind the stuff of mental, mental, to refer to, to, to Harry as mental. I'm not here to refer to anybody as anything. Uh, this is not what I, I'm not here to, to destroy the human dignity of a human being. This never was my task. If I ever did something wrong, that person got from me personally probably a thousand times more than he would have from anybody else. I took responsibility for everything I did in my life, good and bad, uh, but fuck it. The book that was that was that Charles referred to as a bestseller in I don't know how many languages. I like to know what the fuck was translated because American psychologist Daniel Rex Smith was like, uh, yeah, but you're gonna have to look into like certain details. Like this guy was really really diplomatic, you know. He called like a genocide, extermination, a wipeout against me. Let's say he would he would he would use a very diplomatic. He would call this like the biggest disparity in the world. Okay, on one side, almost I'm not gonna say what cretins, and on the other side, myself, literally going around buying old cars and stuff like this at age 50 without family and so on uh, I do like to know exactly what victims yeah I don't go anything about mental I don't want to make any kind of crazy stuff about workaholic this and that uh, but I do like to know what victims uh, wanted the case basically to be seen as right uh, the book, that book, that this particular case, which some American diplomat uh, stated, uh, oh, if he did this, and then he is finished, and then he is finished. If if he did this to Charles, then the, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead. No, I'm not fucking dead. Uh, I'm still alive, as you see. I'm still well. Uh, I'm not anywhere near close dead uh, because I'm a fucking workaholic for one thing. I'd like to know, you see, this, you did, if you did this, it kind of reminds me of the issue in front of the parties and memorials when the guy told me when I asked him if he can help me out in completely early stages, when they basically got maybe one or two statements, something finally from me through the torch in front of this partisan memorials, if I started to ask him to help me out and he said, 
No, 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 it's too, it's already too late for you. You know, you already said that. If you wouldn't even say this, it would have been too late. But you said the stuff like this, this is how they did. Basically, I just fucking die, basically. Give up, give in. I'd like to know what is written inside of that bestseller because, man, uh, I think hardly I can agree on any kind of issues this uh, big asset, big sets uh, had demonstrated about me. Fuck this. Uh, Charles, even after 28 years, I am uh, still the biggest disparity. Let's be diplomatic in this world. 97, 98, that stuff happened with the Charles. I think it was in 98, Trump said, I don't know. Nah, man, they are always looking forward to one thing. And what's that? Always to look victims. Always victims. Remember, they are victims. You, drugged up, bitten up, you're a fucking abuser. So, Charles, who is your daddy and what does he do? Uh, Charles, if you want to do somebody a favor, um, because the Norwegian king did not understand apparently uh, why, why when this church came why when they when they ring in this church where the hell did I come from with idea that they're assembling the Vikings uh, that they are gonna do something is what the police officer stated me uh, when 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 the bells rang uh, he said now they are gonna do something they are gonna do something and I said what are they gonna do and he said, they, they are called the Vikings. They are going to assemble the Vikings now. And they are going to do something. Oh, okay. So I was like, yeah. So if you want to do somebody a favor, Charles, if you want to do a favor to somebody, Norwegian King told me later, Hakon also told me that I embarrassed them. That they are no sure, they are no longer sure about what goes on. If you want to do somebody a favor, Charles, because I think you did a lot. You 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 had a you created a your huge sheer shit in this case. Go ahead and explain about scheme Pauls as they would have me carry scheme Pauls for the staff members or for you guys. Explain how on this trail to Sevnitsa when we're doing hiking during the hiking how I started to view them as a swords you know how I started to view this skiing balls basically as a swords as we walked as I walked next to the kings do a favor and explain, tell the truth, Charles, about what the fuck went on. If you if you if you want to do somebody a favor, explain what what actually was a skeleton in the closet behind a scheme pause alone. No, I never was dangerous for anybody. I never attacked anybody. It was just not my part of personality. Uh, they would let me carry this pause. All the way until I don't know what year was it like 2010, 2012. I don't know. Then they started to think that maybe it's not a good idea to let me carry scheme paws anymore. So, you know, this shit is not funny to me. This is not funny, um, but since you're a victim. I'd like to get a real input from you about this issue alone. If you have enough strength to go and give the truth. Okay. 
if you can do this, if you can do something like this, then I'm going to really start to consider you as a workaholic. Because the workaholic, that's a little bit more than just going out there and pick up millions and billions, basically. It takes much, much, much more. You know, it's a deeper understanding behind the workaholic, which, by the way, the people in the West, when they try to be workaholics, so they can build themselves to accommodate their families, so actually buy themselves homes, create life savings to send kids to colleges and so on. Uh, there is much more, and the system would not allow them. You know, it's the system that ends basically on that expression workaholic because that's when the person becomes ambitious it's the biggest stall that person will go through that's when the system takes total advantage of one a person gets robbed even of his health so there are different meanings to the workaholic but you need to understand that i know what a workaholic is if you can do me a favor if you can do if you want me to start to consider you as a workaholic, start with this here. Tell the truth, Charles. You owe it to Norwegian King. You owe it to others.